Esta es una película del pinzón de manglares, rara en el único en el mundo. <risa> The mangrove finch is one of the most threatened birds on earth, with a real risk of imminent extinction. They are one of the 13 finches known as Darwin's finches that are endemic to the Galapagos. Mangrove finches were once through all the mangroves on Isabella and on some of the mangroves in Fernandina. Now they are confined to only 30 hectares of fragments of mangrove forests on the western side of Isabella. There may well be fewer than 120 individuals left. You can find several other finches in the mangroves, but only the mangrove finch lives, breeds and feeds in the mangroves. Mangrove finches like mangrove forests with a mix of white mangrove, black mangrove and red mangrove. They prefer to nest in the very tall black mangroves which grow up to 20 metres high. In December, at the start of the wet season, males start building their nests and they sing beside them stridently, hoping to attract a female. When a female selects a nest and a male, they finish the nest, the female lays two, three or four eggs and incubates them. The male will assist with feeding the female. Mangrove finches share their mangrove habitat with lots of other species that use the mangroves for part of their life. Things like the marine iguanas and the land iguanas. The introduced ship rats are a grave threat to the mangrove finches. They climb the trees, raid the nests of eggs and chicks, and probably eat the females as well. How did you find out that the rats are a problem, that we need to feed the rats poison? Well, about three years ago, before I got here, they did um, 
they knew that nesting success of mango finches was very low, so they did a long-term nest monitoring study, and as well as monitoring the success of the mango finches, they placed artificial nests so that the mangroves were plasticine eggs and um, using the teeth marks of rats, and most of those nests were within the first night out. The eggs had been... In one sure. night? Yep. Yes. In one night the plasticine had rat teeth marks. That's right. The rats liked their plasticine. They did. We are controlling the rats with a grid of bait stations loaded with bradificum poison. This is our goal. A more recent introduction is the bot fly, Philornis. It's a fly that parasitizes the chicks. They lay their eggs in the nostrils of the chicks. The eggs hatch, the larvae crawl into the nest and suck blood and eat skin of the nestlings as they develop. At present we don't have a treatment for the Philornis bot flies. Scientists are working to isolate a pheromone to use in pheromone traps. We hope in the future to be able to release and re-establish mangrove finches back into their historic range around Isabella, um, even including the Ramsar site of mangroves beside the town of Puerto Villamil on Isabella Island.